Let me be clear. I ain't about to talk no about this man. But Stephen A's wildin' roll the clip. If Steph Curry beats LeBron in this series, and dare I say, wins his fifth NBA championship. Right. We might have to remove LeBron James off of Mount Rushmore and put Steph Curry on it. That's so dick so That's right oh! on Steph. I believe that LeBron James is the second <laughs> best play in the history of basketball. Why LeBron got to go? This ain't about yeah, exactly. any shade on him. What happened to three? It's about elevating Steph. He'd have one title more. He can get, okay. Okay, come here, come here, come here, come here, Stephen. Okay, God, well, you said Stephen A. Stephen's disrespectful. Come here, Stephen. So you said LeBron is two, right? Meaning Jordan is your one, right? I don't know who your three and four is, but if it's about elevating Steph Curry, wouldn't four go away? <laughs> what the what? What the fuck is happening? And, and this is like the way I view basketball debate and discourse is completely different from people, bro. I don't view it to give you the numbers and the games to tell you why you're stupid. No, I want to hear you talk. I believe I am a firm believer of the saying everybody is two questions away from losing their argument. That is my I firmly believe that shit because how uh, uh, it's four. <laughs> Take away the four. What? How? I don't even want to get my computer science back, bro, but that logically does not make sense. <laughs> Thank you. Like, 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 Bron like just moves from two to crazy. three, put Curry at two, whoever was at three goes to four. Thank and, uh, you. <laughs> sit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Like, like, chat, we'll get into it. We'll, we'll, I think this is the explanation video versus the actual one he did. That's fine. We'll get into it. But I want y'all to understand this logically. It's, it, it's a fallacy. It just, it doesn't make sense. Then LeBron, three of those titles, he beat LeBron. I'm not trying to say that Steph Curry belongs on it. I'm saying that well, it's a now. discussion. <laughs> If he, if he beat LeBron, Jimmy Smith just uh, ring, shaking now. things up. Jay Will's obviously <laughs> feeling good about it, but Wendy, I'm going to start with you on this one that was <laughs> yesterday. Uh, do you agree with Stephen A. on his Mount Rushmore? <clears throat> Jay Smith. Mr. Smith. Oh, uh, shit. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh oh, shit. Hey, no. <laughs> been, you've been in California for too long. <laughs> too much sun, too much blue skies, too okay. much 75 degrees. Okay. Come back to the cold gray of the northeast the gritty streets you need you've been lost shout out to the bit. gritty streets man this is great a and c y'all la boys be okay. um, too chill man i, I have so much respect for Steph. nah 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 i'm pausing the video bro because ever since bron moved to la it's just been um run i'm cool i'm in la with the palm trees what happened to cleveland bron bro gritty bron <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Some, something happened when he went to to, to Miami too. I'm um, Bron. I'm in South Beach. But the real Bron is the Bron in Cleveland. I ain't going to lie, man. That's gritty Bron right there. No cap. Bro, my, my kill is, bro, ultimately, I'm from the DMV, but I I, I love warm weather. I ain't about to diss him. <laughs> I, I love warm weather, bro. I can't I can't diss him, bro. It's, it's so sunny. I like the sun. So I like to lay back like, 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 like how the hoes be. Just lay back. Damn, what? a good ass day i get that vibe when i get a haircut up here but like over there that's every day that's just walking outside getting a sandwich that's what i'm saying though it's different when it's every day that does something to you bro you that's know what i'm saying yeah, i i will not disagree with that that's insanely true Ooh. i have been in attendance when he's won all four of his titles mm -hmm. i have been okay, in attendance Damn. Well, he's had some of his great games. <laughs> I was there. Even his non-finals <laughs> uh, games. The, the, the game in Houston where he was scoreless in the first half on the road and then came back and had like 30-something in the second half, 35. I was there last year in game four, one of the premium games of his career in Boston. Yes, He right, is just not, not LeBron, and that's not meant to, to, to drag <laughs> Steph at all. Um, to me, and I, I've been a big believer of Steph is a top 10 all-time player for a while. To me, when you think about someone with four titles – Two MVPs and a finals MVP. You're talking about a list of like five or six, seven okay. names. You know, names that you already have talked about. You know, Kareem, Magic, Russell, Jordan, LeBron. Um, yeah. uh, Tim Duncan, I believe, is on that mm -hmm. list. Um, yeah. That is definitely where Steph belongs. Okay. And I know top ten, it's like, what do you take out of whatever? Steph has changed the game. You said it, bro. But what I had an issue with was you giving <laughs> Steph credit for his titles Timothy. coming over LeBron. Come on, man. As if that was a level playing field. It's never been a level oh, playing field. Maybe man, this year, here we go. right now, 
is the first time that LeBron has had a team that has actually been straight level with the Warriors or very, very close to it. And even still, the Warriors were slightly favored coming into this Wow, season. that's the agenda I, push. I, I ain't going to lie. I, I can't, I can't see it. Pick. I can't see I, – I mean, and, and I don't think it comes to this series. I don't think this series decides it. I think LeBron's legacy is in that rock. That rock is not changing. So all if you I want to add that, a face, go ahead. But I can't I, take a face down. All I ask is that y'all give me an opportunity to respond when y'all <laughs> no, okay. I do okay. be feeling oh, that way. Oh, please, please, oh, please, 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 please. Let me handle one thing off the top before I address you, oh, Mr. Smith. Yes, oh, yes, Smith. Yes, yes, your chair today. Pause. I feel the power. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> Can we first off just stop with the Mount Rushmore talk? Oh. They're not even the four best presidents this country has ever had. Oh, Everyone shit. in this room was not even able to vote. I just want to say that off the top. That's our metric for success? That's our Dang. king? I'll leave that conversation for another day. We just use this yeah. as a metaphor. Uh, I, 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 I understand. Got I just had to. Now with you. I, <laughs> such a stupid <laughs> turn okay. in the talk. The Mount Rushmore conversation is the most arbitrary conversation. though. I, I, I ain't going to lie. Top four. Top four, my guy. Really? Honorable mention. Top three plus honorable mention. Oh, my God. Yeah, that, that, that really what it is, bro. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> Top three and honorable mention. Hey, man, it's, it's cool memes. What are we doing? Yeah, hey man. You know what I'm saying? Kendrick, Cole, Drake, and Travis Scott. I guess. Like, wait, 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 see, this is why souls and Satan. Fuck it, I'm not picking the stand back up. See, this is, this is why souls and sage is officially only basketball. <laughs> no, you didn't put Travis. <laughs> and before y'all say Craig, cool. Four? <laughs> Come on, man. You, you ain't mean that. You ain't mean that. Y'all forgot about Travis, man, since that incident, man. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember when Astro World came out, bro. The vibes. Now, the, I remember when Uzi came out. Yeah, since we're going off vibes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say, say, say Astro World was a bigger vibe than Uzi. I, I damn you a lie right now. Then Eternal a take? Not, not EA. Hell no. You went for you went for weak sauce, Uzi. I'm talking love it. Love is rage too. Ah, okay, man. Okay. Man. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, you man. you think I was on your side? You're insane. Listen to Yosemite, bro. Listen to Yosemite. You're insane. Bro. You're insane. You're I saw my Nick. Come on, bro. Chad, if you want to be the funniest chat ever, mix up anybody who previewed this video and commented. But love is rage to Astro World. This is insane. <laughs> <laughs> I've been waiting to say this line to you for so long. Uh oh, you're fired. Stay off the weed. <laughs> oh <laughs> man. Stephen A. You know how I know you. I need to try some. I, I need to try some. Hey, hey yo. Hey. <laughs> Top five, top what is first? Four. You just said the discussion. The discussion. Kudos to you. Elevates everybody to talk about it. You'd even make the stand by saying if he's going to win his fifth NBA championship, he's not. He's going to be on the list. But let me just tell you why. And I love Steph. I say Steph has been a revolutionary player in the history of basketball. Wait a minute. I agree with Wendy. I think he's top ten. I think before it's all said I just and done, discovered something. he will inevitably be in the top five. But LeBron James is one of the two greatest players we've ever seen in the history of the game. And by the way, when I saw you give your list yesterday with Mad Dog and JJ, okay. you may mention the names like Bill Russell, guys that play both sides of the ball. Oh, Bill Russell was nine. Oh, I'm sorry. Not too much, one bro. One time award is really hey, the defensive player of the go. year, but that award actually didn't start until 1968. Right? His career ended in 1969. What? You also gave Michael Jordan <laughs> nine-time first-team all-defense. You gave Kareem five-time first-team all-defense. So what you're telling me is you're setting a standard for people that Jesus not only six, are prolific offensively, chat. but also prolific defensively. So when I look at Steph, generational-type player. But does he play on both sides of the ball the way LeBron James does? I need to see your list, Jay. Mm. Because I ain't going to lie, if you got Steph over Hakeem, what's your list looking like, buddy? I'm going to tell y'all now, I, the way I argue, I like what Jay doing. I probably, if I had to make Jay's argument, I would 100% pull the same shit. Even though Bill Russell's a little contradictory because like, Steph Curry clears him. Almost. Whatever. But, <laughs> but it's, hey, in my point being, I'd make the same argument. However, Jay, what the hell is your list, bro? That's what I'm saying, but, man. But, yo, I'm glad he brought up Bill Russell. Did you see the Mount Rushmore they had? It was MJ, Kareem, and Bill. He said, bump Braun. 
You don't want to know who I'd want to bump up, man. Oh, cap. <clears throat> Mr. 70s, man. Get the fuck off on out of here. Man. This is crazy. Get oh. out of here, buddy. Oh, <laughs> get, my God. Get out of here, buddy. The unstoppable move. Goggles. And he couldn't make the playoffs in his prime. The second guess, greatest score ever I, I in guess, terms of total yeah, points. Yeah, in terms of what? Yeah, yeah. In terms of yeah. total points. <laughs> yeah, no, he's not my second. He's not even better than Steph. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm not even going to say that, but in, ter in terms of point, total points. What? Billy? Billy? You don't know about Billy for real, bro. You don't know about Billy for real, bro. It's this cool. Is, he ain't even better than Yo, yo you don't know about Billy for real, man. He ain't even better than Shaq. All right, man. It's cool. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it's yeah. cool, man. It's, it's, cool. it's, it's all right. It's all right. Draymond in the seven. Draymond in the sixties over here. Just oh yeah, he deserves it all. All right, <laughs> all right bro. Yeah, you trying to get a shit off chat? <laughs> you trying to be me, bro? It's cool. It's cool, bro. What you mean? What you mean? <laughs> it's cool, man. Look, look. It's cool, man. It's cool. We need the hot what takes. We need the hot takes. It's cool, bro. I'm not. That's not a hot <laughs> take, bro. That's facts. First team, all defense. I just find a lot of um. A lot of issues with your argument. All right, so following James Harden's what the? standout performance in game one, the Celtics made it. This is a real conversation we need to have. Two. Harden shot <laughs> two of 14 from the field, which is absurd. <laughs> Prime James it. Harden is back! Oh, <laughs> what happened? What happened? What did Jay I just want to say this. I don't know what happened to Jay Williams. I do want to hear what Stephen A said, but um, we're working on finding that. While, we're, while we do that and or don't do it at all, Yo, here's my thing, right? Ultimately, Stephen A is right to this degree. These playoffs are so great to me because there is a lot on the line for a lot of players. I know D-Book been going crazy, but if KD win, oh, yeah, that, that, that helps him. If LeBron win, oh, <laughs> oh, God, like literally what it's just a matter of do you are you open minded or no? Steph Curry, he would belong in these conversations. And I know it's going to piss y'all off. So I'll do y'all one even better. I am a Kobe Bryant fan. Wouldn't you understand that? All right. Because that that y'all y'all take it away from my credibility when y'all find out I love Kobe and LeBron when I'm in favor. So hopefully it works the opposite way. Kobe fan, die hard Laker fan. Steph Curry, I can't get mad at anybody that says he's better. If he gets his fifth ring, I, can't, I literally can't. Like it, it's offensive seasons rival, if not clear. It's a matter of it's a matter of the team that he was on. Do you value that? It's a matter of um, defense. Obviously, there's several other intri intricacies between Kobe and Steph Curry, but I would be I'm not mad at nobody. I think the Larry Bird discussion. You 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 just lying. <laughs> I ain't gonna I ain't gonna lie. Five ring Steph, especially the two the last two of the three rings he would have had. Just lying. <laughs> like y'all y'all don't even think Clay's good today. Y'all don't even think Jordan Poole's good today. Y'all don't even think Draymond's good today. So if you're telling me he won a chip, yeah, you're lying. Back to back, so, too, it, bro. Yeah, I'm about to say back to back championships past his prime. Yeah, you're lying. So it's it's a lot of uncomfortable conversations that you would not want to have. But when you really sit back and think about it it's it's no doubt it's and, and i know warriors twitter can be annoying and sped that like for example the whole free throws debacle stupidest stupidest trend of the night easily but it nah it's it's tough it's tough if steph gets five so i'm on board with Stephen a's logic four might be the extreme upset logic but taking out lebron just logically i mean <laughs> that, just, that just didn't make sense that was the worst part about his take the the moving lebron out the mount rushmore shit that didn't make any sense but like like Sage said, uncomfortable conversations need to be had about Steph Curry, bro. I ain't gonna lie, cause I think the 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 stratosphere he entered in last season after that fourth ring was a top ten talent of all time, and he was one of those players. Yeah, he's a top ten player of all time, but I can't see him top five right now. I think there's certain players where you can wake up one day and think Magic's three. You can wake up one day and think Kareem is, you know, three. Shaq is three. I think Bill Russell is actually in that conversation as well. Wilt is in that conversation. Shaq is in that conversation. But that latter half, the Tim Duncans of the world, I'm going I'm to say it, I'm going to say it. The Tim Duncans of the world, you know what I'm saying? The Hakeems of the world, the Steph Currys of the world. It's hard to wake up and think, yo, this is the third greatest player of all time. It's hard. But Steph, if he wins that fifth one, bro, and the longevity argument, I, I, I'm looking at his career GGs, right now, bro. GGs. In my In my opinion, he's been great since 2013. This has been 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 years since then. So that whole longevity thing is just a matter of time, in my opinion. 
I I think after this season, he's still got like two to three years left of being, at, at the very least, a 25, 26 point per game scorer. And then he's going to tail off to being a, a 22, 21 point per game scorer, barring any injury. Now, you never know, especially with a, with a player like Steph, but you never know. But knock on wood. And at that point, bro, we're looking at a resume of, what, 14 to 16 years of greatness um, probably a 13 to 14 time All Star, a 10 to 11 All Time NBA team member, five rings, two MVPs, the only unanimous one. Like, what are what are we doing at that point? Hopefully, two Finals MVPs. Not the go, to my opinion, but a hey, top five, top five, man. E- easy, easy. Um, tell you the truth, bro. And this, I, I might be going too far, or anything like that, because you know that that's what discourse is nowadays, going too far. LOL. But seriously, what are I struggle to hear an argument for a five ring Steph not being better than Magic at this moment in time? Mm-hmm. I, 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 maybe I need to cool off, drink some water, eat some food, and I can come up with it. But off the dome, y'all, dead ass. What? argument would you have outside of and it just came to mind outside of if magic never got sick he could have actually just he, 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 for all we fucking know he cleared so they're like but that's on some like um atachi bullshit like ultimately <laughs> we're looking at what he did and a five ring steph what what do you what do you say to that <laughs> like the, the rings is done yeah he passed better curry scored better they're both not fantastic defensively magic is tall damn like that like that's what i'm talking about but um ultimately those conversations are always gonna have pushback until it's like curry wins seven then at that point Nick, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right old man go to sleep type shit <laughs> yeah it's like, it's like all right bro all right timmy chill <laughs> well ultimately though and that's why this is i guess is my rapping point that's why i'm not slandering this dude like I'm a slander pool taking 30 footers. I'm a slander your fan base talking about free throws, even though you shot 53 three. <laughs> I'm a slander and, and your coach said it was y'all fault. I'm I'm a slander y'all actually fouling on defense a lot. Slander the hell out of Draymond. He's Draymond. It's 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 what you gotta do when you go against Draymond. I'm a, I'm a even defend LeBron a bit when we talking about the 2015 16 thing. They just won the wrong rings. One thing I won't do is ever slander that motherfucker 30. It's not happening. I'm not I'm not gonna be the YouTube clip. I'm not gonna have Curry sitting at the press conference talking about some yeah, niggas saying this it ain't happening to me i ain't talking about bro that nigga him all right okay okay <laughs> if that's you that's fine but if lebron beats his ass man can you beat lebron without a no oh, my man Hey man, what got going? What you y'all, got going y'all on, see, man? You see you the got... jersey, bro. <laughs> he made the jersey you work for him. You see the jersey. <laughs> Here you go. Can bro. he beat LeBron? I just fully said, healthy without I'm, I'm Kevin like, Wayne. I just said. I just said they won the wrong rings in 2015. I believe the Cavs probably do get it. Done. Even well, I'm not gonna lie to you. I do think the Warriors would have won. But in 2015, people say the Cavs should have won. In 2016, keep the same energy. The Warriors should have won. So ultimately. I think they won the wrong rings. Now, is it sad we ain't get the trilogy? Yeah. Wayne, you fucked it up. But Wayne's hilarious. And Wayne's one of the best to ever do it his damn self. But they, they, I, it would have been 1-1 one, one regardless. To me, I think the Warriors won is a bit. And I don't want to push that argument. But this is my hot take for the day, I guess. <laughs> As he holds up the Kevin Durant jersey. Kevin my Wayne, hot take bro. For y'all. <laughs> the 2016 <laughs> Warriors should have won take is so easily much more of a defense than 2015 Cavs should have won take. That... But either way, it's obvious they won the wrong rings at worst. So now he wants to pull the injury card. All right, bro. And, and, and uh, not, 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 you don't want to talk about suspensions. Right, bro, you, you, true, and you don't want to talk about suspensions and other injuries. Exactly. Like it's literally they just swapped rings. They like, just they just swapped it at at best. They swapped it. Yo, yo, Kevin Curry needed you, bro. If Curry loses, if Curry wins, Curry didn't need you, bro. I ain't gonna lie. But at least Curry got three three wins prior to his prior to his what if starting. Curry already had three wins. Then then the whole Draymond three suspension wins? thing. Yeah, three wins. That was a three one. Three what wins. We that's what we, that's what we doing now. We got enough three no, one no, no, leads. No, 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 no. I'm saying I'm saying I'm saying before the controversy for LeBron in 2015, it was like game one. They both of the motherfuckers was chopped. Kelly Olynyk put that boy in the Alberto Del Rio on ball and um. Kyrie, Kyrie just got hurt in the fourth, but that was in game one. Curry did it three times, and then his man's got cooked. 
So I'm just saying, y'all be talking about 2015, 2015, 2016, at best, equal hoes. But uh, truthfully, logically, 2016 has more evidence. Hey, hey, chat. <laughs> this sounds like a scared Curry fan, bro. <laughs> hey, what's a scared Big Curry Big Bron! Fan? I am Big a Bron! <laughs> I Come am on. actively... Yo, yo, I am yo, actively... Yo, Sage! Yo, Sage! This is Best boy. point guard of all time. <laughs> Come on, fun. stop. Hold on, bro. Since we getting fucking jerseys, hold on, man. Let me be clear. I, again, I ain't talking about Wardell. I am actively a Lakers fan. I, I am like, what are we doing? I have a, I have a USA Olympics Kobe jersey. What are we doing? <laughs> I'm just not, I'm just not about to lie to y'all for the content. I ain't gonna do it. But it's, it's still Re- LeBron, Ray, Ron James, if I have to say which player is better. You know what I'm saying? But that's all I'm saying. And that's not slander. I'm not slandering stuff. I ain't got time for that nigga give me 50. Because I thought I was going to light a beam. I'm not doing that shit. Shout out to the Kings, though. I, I earned hell of respect for y'all. But still. Mm-mm. All right, man. I'm going to see you in those Urkel spaces. Um, We'll catch you in the next video. <laughs> You will never catch me. <laughs> hey, no disrespect to, I guess his name's Urkel, or any of them. Big Urk. Nah, yeah, I'm not. Nah, I, the, the warrior spaces be nuts. I ain't doing that. Hell nah. <laughs>